Hey guys, Jim from Measure Square here. Welcome to part 15 of the takeoff tutorials and the getting started series for Measure Square 8. In this video, we will cover splitting divided floor regions into separate rooms. As you can see, we already have our divider lines drawn within this room. This is still considered one room, but we do have our divider lines that would, at the moment, separate product if we drop that in there. If we would like to make three separate rooms using the divider lines as our walls, we can go to the Room Edit tool in the Shapes menu, select Split Room. Now you'll see those divided regions have turned into completely separate rooms. If I left click on Room 1 and drag it away, you will see that is now a completely separate room, just like Room 2 and Room 3. Now if we take a step back and have this single room selected again, we have another option in dividing this into more than one room. We can again go to the Room Edit tool, select our Draw Wall tool, which we used in a previous video. And now if I go into a corner of this room, I can left click on that wall to start a new wall. I will left click to make my turn. And when I finish this wall on a corresponding wall and left click, I will now have drawn a whole new room by connecting these two walls. So I will right click to deselect the tool. And if I select room 1-1 and drag it away, you will see it is now a separate room, very similar to using the divide tool and using the split floor function as well. In the next video, we will cover adding a product legend, notes, and handwritings to our diagram.